Hey. What's up? <laughs> What's up? Triumphant Man, return. Am I handsome or what? You Every are. time. You are. Look at this fashion. Yeah. Are you content um, with the increased squishiness to rock that fashion? Because I think you're, look you're looking great. Uh... You just want to consider my defense is a bit. Uh, well, I mean, it's fine. Ultimately, if you're fine with it, and if you're planning to not get hit, uh, you you are. You're looking great. You're looking great. I'm so cute. You're very cute. Yeah, you can uh, get yourself steal up right there. Um, so you you took your tour of the demon ruins, and you've seen uh, most of what it has to offer. Mm-hmm. And you've uh, opened up the elevator back up to here, so that's pretty handy. And you took a little side detour. You peeked, you peeked into a hallway with a couple of bugs, and then you saw a little bit of lost Isolith. Right. We peeked in, and then we you saw the title. I saw some scary butts, and I walked out. And then we walked out. Um, yeah, so... You know, you just, uh, you, that, that fog gate leading to the, um, leading to the, uh, uh, uh the fire, uh, demon. Yes, the fire um, tree. Yeah, was basically your, your first gold, or your second golden gate, right? The first of which was Sense Fortress, uh, not Sense Fortress, um. The Duke's Archives. Duke's Archives, correct. Yes. Uh, yeah, so you can you can head right back to it. Um, the choices, of course, of your areas continue to be open. You can continue down that pathway, or you can uh, go elsewhere. I'm going down. Ignore the moving dudes. Down. Ignore the moving dudes. These statues that move? Yep. Just don't think too hard about them. Okay, they're not looking for trouble. 22k souls. Yes. Interesting. Get out of my face. Not enough for a level, but enough to do a lot of other things. Like in the sword, it's pretty cute, and it does uh, it does good damage, mm -hmm. and it's tapping into my my good stuff, right? All Your my build. intelligence. Mm -hmm. and... Huh? Another bonfire. And another fog gate. So this is where you start to see parts of where the game is actually more forgiving than it seems. Because whether you, when you, once you beat that last demon, you walk out and then you have an upstairs or a downstairs. And you're like, shit, I don't know which one to do. And I kind of want to just back up because I beat a boss. Yeah. I need to sit somewhere. And then if you pick upstairs, you will get an elevator back to a bonfire. Or if you pick downstairs, you got a bonfire anyway. So either choice leads to safety. Even though at the time you're kind of scared yeah. to make a choice. That's that's a first. Double fire. Okay, I saw an item on the side here, so. And a nice fog gate at the end over there. Huh. Where's the angle? Let's go back up and see. Okay, so it is beyond the thing. Right under. So yeah, there's more zone for you. To explore. Soul of a brave warrior, that's good. That looks like a big drop. Last time with that fucking ceiling drop. <laughs> that was cute. Skills. That was cute. Uh, 
Damn, okay. I'm gonna have to buy more prison stones at some point. You probably should. Not bad. Feels like there's a threshold at which point it exponentially gets more violent and painful in the drop damage. Feels like you can fall a while and then it suddenly goes. Yeah, you know. <laughs> so, like. It seems similar to the previous area I was in, but. Clearly, I haven't been here. And now, um. Well, it looks like the hallway you were walking in where you, uh. Well, that led to the, the new zone. Yeah, uh. There's a fog gate here. Sure. I'm curious about what's behind it. Sure. Traverse the white light. Okay, let's do it. Best of luck. Okay. Oh, what the fuck is that? Centipede demon. Whoa, okay. what a hit. That hurt it. What a hit. What an unbelievable hit. And I went in the flames. But she got an item. Oh my god, okay. Hold up. <laughs> there was lava everywhere? Yes. There was. <laughs> okay. Alright, okay. One thing at a time. What did I just pick up? It was a charred... Orange charred... Ring. ring reduces lava damage. <laughs> Yo, what? <laughs> All right, Reggie. Do you want to guess what just happened and why? So I did an untargeted soul spear. Yep. And then I I, I hit it. I saw the, the damage go down. Mm -hmm. And then a little thing came to me mm -hmm. and I killed it. Mm -hmm. And I automatically got the ring without picking up anything. Yep. So, that's a fight that is really annoying because of the floor. <laughs> but if you cut his arm off... <laughs> that was great! Oh, shit! Sniped! <laughs> Welcome Have fun, man. to today. Have fun, dude. <laughs> An orange ring enchanted by a witch reduces lava damage. Just hit that cruise control button. <laughs> We're now cruising at a a nice 85. Traffic is light. The sun is shining. An orange ring enchanted by a witch reduces lava damage since his sores were inflamed by lava from birth. His witch sisters gave him this special ring, but fool that he is, he readily dropped it. And from that spot, a terrible centipede demon was born. This is the, 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 what I was referring to earlier. So that directly references Ceaseless Discharge. Okay. And the area above was where he dropped that ring, which then gave life to the centipede demon. Oh. And his sisters... Was the, the body that I found in the corner. The daughters of Isolith. The daughters of the Witch of Isolith. So that implies that he was the son of the Witch of Isolith. What about the gear that I found in the corner? Uh, yep, the um, Kalana's ropes. Yeah. Um, but you met Kalana, so clearly that is likely not Kalana's body. 
Uh, that's but another sister, if anything. All right. Well. So, Quilag, Kalana, the fair lady, and a fourth sister, uh, as well as uh, the ceaseless discharge, appear to be the children of the witches of Isla, of the witch of Isla. <laughs> well. Let's go see what this is about. Let's yeah. see how good that yeah. thing is. You, I mean, you're strong, but like you shot a untargeted <laughs> soul spear and it hit his arm. The god. And did enough damage to give you that ring. The god. Which usually if you kill him, it drops. But if you get his arm like a tail, <laughs> right? If you happen to get lucky enough, I, I just... I don't even know what to make of it. Dude, that is godlike. I don't even know what to make of it, but, you know. All right. We take those. I mean, clearly you do more than take those. This one missed. This one missed. So I can go in the lava? Oh, that's substantial. It's very substantial. It, it it makes lava damage as if it were like you're wearing a damage or a ring or of some kind. But the boss is still a boss. Oh yeah, the boss is still a boss. I was feeling myself. I, I was. <laughs> I can't believe what just happened. It's pretty wild. <laughs> now, it goes without saying then that since you can just go fight, you can like, you know, you're going to not have you're not gonna you're not gonna care but um the ground you stand on ends up being when you're not fucking rocking that luck uh a big part of yeah. this fight you have to pay a huge attention to the ground and then it becomes a problem because you're looking for a better place to fight and standing and fighting in that first area kind of sucks so then you start moving around and doing what you can you know <laughs> Uh, uh, and and you make do <laughs> with the situation. It's hilarious. I'm a boss. I sure. <laughs> oh damn! Okay, you got moves. Are you trashing about? That damage is insane, though. Nice. Nice heal. Sip trade. Run. Oh, my God. Sorry about the bitrate, folks. Nothing I can do. <laughs> Whoa! Can't see shit, Captain. Woo! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Woo! I mean, I guess he takes that much damage. I must have forgot. I thought it would take more than five swings. <laughs> that was great. Dude, if I wasn't that lucky at the beginning and fighting over there, it would have been horrible. Okay, so he has low magic resistance. So you've also got the damage type that he fucking hates. Perfect matchup. You're using the sword and you're hitting him with the with the spells that'll do the most damage against him. Perfect matchup. So yeah, you run over here. And then you keep on fighting. And then you then you then you have nowhere to move and he's bigger than this entire thing. And then you look over here, and then you have one option, which is over here in this corner. Which means you don't have to worry about the lava behind you. Or, where you were, over there. 
and then like you know you end up playing a game of like cat and mouse on the lava but when he jumps around a bunch and pushes you off the lava you have to psych you have to circle back onto the land <laughs> you know so that's what that fight usually looks like that's usually cool. yeah when you're a weakling oh yeah hey man that's fine <laughs> yuck it up <laughs> What a start. All right. Yeah. That was great. <laughs> Enjoy it while it lasts. I I will. I will. Because I don't know when this game is going to be like, hey, what do you know? You got a lot of souls on you. I do. Uh. Sad. But yes, that ring you got weakens lava as, as its effect on you. It's pretty good. Uh, let me just fully explore the walls in case there's like some hidden items somewhere behind the pillars mm -hmm. or whatever. Is there anywhere else where lava was bothering you? Um. Well, there was the the area where we killed all those those Tauruses, right? But sure that's is. been taken care of. Uh, well, there's that item on top of that little hill that we're talking about. Yeah, so that's that's this is the item that I was okay trying to not bring up. <laughs> that's fair. <laughs> when I you know, which is like when it comes in the future. When it comes in the future, you might get some a little, a little help, or with your um, with your <laughs> you know, with your oh, ring. Oh, we take these dubs. Yes. Hell Absolutely. yeah. Okay. Well. You know, build it up, enjoy yeah. it. Just, just for a bit, you know. Make your bed. <laughs> Sometimes it's scary. Make your bed. All right, I guess we're committed. So, uh, after this, I have twenty some. What's in my pockets? At this point. Your biggest, your biggest returns are going to be off of um, uh, straight up int and endurance. Intelligence, endurance. Okay. Yeah. So no more strength. Well, I mean, it depends on what you're swinging, but like at this point, as in with what you currently, yeah, my intel use, stuff is the thing. Your damage is coming off of that stat yeah. hard. And I love my magics. All right. Um, Proud knight and soul brave. I four soul brave. Not enough to um, to pop another level, I don't think, though. So. Uh, large or, or regular? Because proud is uh, proud's two, and brave is is five. Brave soul of a brave warrior is five, so I have twenty k, twenty two k. But how far over forty is your level now? Forty two. Oh, okay. I can just pop the twenty. You could. Okay. Sweet. Anything else you wanted to buy? Because mm. right now I'm in... I've been using that ring of steel protection to buff my defense. Mm -hmm. But if I was to use uh, one of those magic rings that uh, buff my my sorcery. Uh, if you want those magic rings, you can it's go... 20k, You right? can go buy those, yeah. But I would have to use it and then maybe respec for better defense on my gear. Depends. Um, I mean, if you're attached to that, yeah, you could you can respec for better gear, or you can. I mean, I don't know if you're how attached you are to the gear, but you can try to make it stronger. See what the upgrade path is, but like that seems. Oh, on the armor. And yeah, but that that that's admit, rare though. You it, said, right? Well, it's more like. It's more like if you feel like you like a piece and you know you're gonna wear it, okay. then keep it, keep then upgrade it. Yeah, but I don't if know you, if I'm gonna see something better than this that I want to wear though. Yeah, so this is maxed, so that's fine. I might get the ring then. Okay, then you. So yeah. let's travel might to well, Firelink. Might as well warp into it. Um. Yeah. So was Logan, or no, it was the student that had the rings? I believe so. Um, and then, uh, the partner had, had rings as well, but he had, um, I think his was the, like, the bite rings. Oh, hello. Why, of course I don't mind teaching you sorceries, but now that you've located Master Logan, I can't imagine that I can be of much help. 
two things are first, okay. second, then oh. Oh, I already bought it. Goodbye then. Do stay safe. Oh damn! Did you buy the the strength thing? I guess I already bought it. Yeah, the uh, bellowing dragon quest. Dragon yes, crest. you did buy it. And does it show a uh, triangle again? No number change here. No, it doesn't show. Okay. Well, I hope it's good to be a 20k ring. Um, as as far as I believe, uh, it's it's uh, a decent boost for your pyromancies and your sorceries. Okay. 20% buff. That's pretty good. 20%. Approximately. That's good. Um, what about my gear then? Mm -hmm. My defense seems all right. So the, yeah, the duration ring, uh, you, you don't really care for, right? The duration, no. Okay. Well, like, how would that affect? You don't. Sorceries? I don't think you use any sorceries that are that, that, lines, that need right? like yeah. Like power. magic weapon would help, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but I'm not using that. So the other thing is, if you don't have any gear here that you particularly feel fond of, or like that would suit you don't forget that Dommel over up under the bridge has more boss gear for you right remember the set the, the set of uh, yeah. Ornstein the set of Gwendolyn the set of the Sentinel he has all the boss armors up there as well yeah let's go shop yep let's see what he has I remember you were taking a look at it but then I think there was a kind of a like we'll come later what Yo, pocket strong. Yo, we got stuff. <laughs> Don't oh, forget what? about us. Uh, Damn. I know I was from the top. Yo, you you didn't hear the rest of his boys cheering <laughs> when they <laughs> saw that leg. Like, hey, let's go. Make it look like a chump. <laughs> Daryl? What the heck? Let's go, Daryl. Like, right after he did that dodge, <laughs> he looked over back at them. Like, yeah, yeah, I got this, I got yeah, this. Yeah, he looked back at them like, guys, I got it! I did it! <laughs> hey, it was for the team, let's go! Yeah. Shout out, Sterile. Good job. Hey, <laughs> Shemai. I didn't expect to meet anybody here. I suppose great minds think alike, eh? <laughs> Hmm. I'm afraid I'd... Nothing new. Yep. Purchase item. Crystal stuff. And then, yeah. He's got, uh... What is that? At least four or five sets on him. Oh, it's got a few more? Ornstein. Moonlight. So what would be interesting in here? I need some good armor. Well... I mean, a lot of these are solid. The question is just like, look at the weight and look at the um, the function, and then look at the fashion. You know, see what you, what kind of kind of bore you want to be. This looks cool. Um, Armor of the Glorious. Yeah. The, well, so you can see what he he's that's what he's wearing right in front of you. So that's that's literally what the preview would be. Okay. Holding. Yeah, and of course, well, uh, it is a shame then, but no matter. No, not to worry. Come back again. I'm always available. Not every trade was meant to be. What I was going to mention. More in store for us someday, sometime. As he keeps going, uh, the Gwendolyn set is ma is magic uh, enhancing, so you might also, you know, enjoy that in particular. But but I think it yeah. So it's just it's just the helmet. Um, oh, the helmet. We'll take a look. Go look. look go, yes. go to his event. Go. Just want to look at this first. So like, um, I'm at forty six point six right now, and this is ten. This is six. This is eleven. 
10, 11, 6. I should, I didn't, I simply. Yeah. Worst comes to worst, we can pull out the, the fucking build calculator, which is a website that, like, you can pump, you can <laughs> drop down menus and math. Just select everything you have. Yeah. And it gives you, oh, this yeah. is what you what have. Do you want to know? Equip load. Yeah. Do you want to know what your, what are your stats? Okay. What, what do you, you want best in slot? We can help you figure that out. Very helpful. If you feel like fucking crunching specifics. So which one did you want me to look at? Well, if you go down past the Armor of the Glorious, you can get to the, the exactly the Moonlight set. And the crown of the Dark Sun. Enhances all magic. Mm -hmm. It would mean taking the Boar Helmet off, of course. Yeah. Um, whereas the robes themselves don't enhance magic, but... Um, that's uh, but it has good magic defense, I guess. That's what, yeah, that, uh, as robes might do. Um, but if we're playing fashion here, right? Because again, like you know, boar trade off might be rough, but it depends on what you like, you know. It does look cool, it does look cool. It looks almost like the sunlight maggot yeah. without the without light, the maggotry, mm -hmm. without the maggotry, exactly. <laughs> Um, okay, this seems interesting because of the magic buffs. Worth consideration for the money you have um, to, at the very least, see if the damage uh, stacking is something you want. Because the moment you put that on, you're just going to see the damage go up, right? This looks cool as well. Ornstein is a badass. And then... This might be a bit too heavy. And... I don't know how it would look. Hmm. So here's the thing, right? Because your endurance is at uh, 28, like, as opposed to 38 or so, you're going to have a stricter time with, like, yeah, the, he the, the heavier stuff, right? I'm tempted that by this. I think I'm going to buy it. It's worth it for yeah. the uh, for what situational preferences. Uh, and you got the money for it. Mm-hmm. Okay, and then... Of these bodies and legs, since you've... You, it seems like you like Havel's arms. Yeah. Right? So of these bodies and legs... 91 defense... 47... 70... And then, of course, there's what you have already in your inventory, too. So. Mm -hmm. What's your current um, equip load? Uh, 46.6. I think it's like 104 or something. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. That was a fine trade. I have this funny feeling we'll meet again soon. And we'll make another fine trade, of course. Uh. 102. Yeah, you can figure something out. Crown of the Dark Sun. So... So this goes down to 41. <coughs> and then... These robes of the Shadowler. Excuse me. 53 defense. Um, yeah, so you're getting an extra 20% magic damage off that ring. And I, the crown gives you an extra 10%. Okay. Man. That's that's good. Mm -hmm. um, the role of the Chandlers is 53. <laughs> but now I can maybe put something heavier. Well, your goal is to be below 51, right? Yes. Right on 51 is fine, right? Right on 51 is fine. Okay. Uh, actually, it might be not fine. Might be not fine. Let's try it. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. That's kind of weird, though. You're weird. <laughs> You're very weird. You're absolutely weird. You're absolutely weird. Put the boar helmet on with uh, with Havels there. <laughs> oh, the fashion. Uh, yeah, so it's, it's not as bad. But the problem with Havels, which Fixture. exactly Havels is such an awesome set. But it's made of rock. Yeah. And everything else is metal. 
So the rock is not going to sheen. Yeah, if I could polish it, it would be better. Absolutely. I had the same feeling. But anyway, if you yeah. can if you can wear that, then you're gonna be okay with like a lot of other other options. You know, if you want Ornstein body, you can go with Ornstein body. Um, and I mean, the rest of the Gwendolyn set is it's pretty, but obviously it's not gonna do the numbers. Mm. Um. Yeah. I think, but I think the Ornstein set was cheap, though, right? I think it was like eight thousand a piece instead of ten. I sh I, I sh Purchase. Yeah, seven in it, so it was a little, a uh, little cheaper than the. It's a bit lower in defense, right? Uh, for the weight, yeah. Uh, hold on, seventy versus the chat versus the Chandler or versus Havels. Versus Havels, definitely. Versus the Channeler. I think it's more. Yeah, it's more. Yeah. Okay. How would... Yeah, work. let's get the Orstein armor then. Okay. Might need to pop, but you can get at least one piece. And try talking to him after you buy it, too. Well, I'm certain we will make a good trade eventually, so I am willing to share some tips. If you see kindling in the catacombs, use divine weapons. That will repel the reassembling skeletons. That would have been useful. Well... Even though we figured it out, but it took a bit. Yeah, also you have to, like, just once you see, once you meet him, he doesn't return to Firelink until after a couple of other, um zones get cleared okay so you might by the time you get that tip you might have already cleared yeah. the area you know but i mean yeah well i'm certain we will same make stuff so okay I'm to share the cursed oh. ghosts of new londo are formidable foes to face them you will require special arms or a cursed body the quickest way to be cursed try the bug-eyed lizards in the sewer desperate measures to be sure so he straight up tells you. Yeah. But he tells you at a point when you probably are already past it. But this is how you find out, right? Alternative pathways. You can go kill the fire channelers. Not channelers, the, the, the resurrectors. Um, or you can get a divine weapon. You can take a bunch of transient curse. Or go physically get cursed. Or use a cursed weapon. You know? Giving you alternatives. If you're yes, a... multiple paths to, to these solutions. Nice. Um, Don's great. Pretty helpful fellow. Yeah. Hmm. You are a fine trading partner. Rumor it may be, but I have heard of a surviving ancient dragon who resides in this land. A coterie of undead serves the dragon as they train to become dragons themselves. Sounds unlikely, but you never know, do you? Ash Lake. Dragon Covenant. As they try to become dragons themselves. Dragon Head? Yeah. The further you go in that covenant, it becomes more of your body. Okay. Dragon Body. Wow. Till you go full DT. <laughs> okay. He's saying a lot of stuff. He's got... You spent money with him. He's got some tips. I'm afraid I don't see anything here. Yeah. Uh -huh. So again, the translation of that line, I think, is Thank probably you. just a. That was a fine trade. I have this funny. A confusing one, but. Um, and we'll make another fine trade, of course. There you go. He's got some tips for you. Um, yeah. So take a look. Forty-eight point five. Yeah. I mean, it's good Ornstein. metal. It's Ornstein. Dude. Good metal. Uh, do you want a matching leggings or do you want to keep the Chandler leggings? Um, they both look good. This looks good. They but, both look um, good. Let, let's see what he has. I I didn't expect to meet anybody here. They look That's fucking. The they, you're not gonna go wrong with Ornstein, certainly. So it's uh, six hundred, six thousand. And for the leggings as well. Is a shape, but no matter. 
Come back again. Yeah, you've got you've got the pocket souls. Mm-hmm. Items. Uh, let's pop one of those and one of those. No, I just want the leggings, so... Uh, then you just the lower one, then. Shit! Hey, I? I didn't expect, I suppose. You're a good guy, Dom. Dom's alright. Leggings. 6,000. afraid I don't thank you that was a fine yeah trade. I have this funny feeling we'll meet again it looks soon. like you have like you make another fine trade kind of like fancy um, hakama pants you know with the with the Chandler leggings but or the Chandler waist cloth but uh, yeah I actually prefer the Chandler I actually do too yeah <laughs> yeah yeah, that yeah. Looks weird yeah boar shaman Poor Shaman. I agree. I, I don't think that looks weird. I think that's fine. But what you had was more... I think the legs are weird. Like well, it's because they're skinny, but your head's so big. <laughs> if you had a small... If you took the boar helmet off, you'd had a small head, and it would look more normal. <laughs> that's that's the deal. Yeah, you know. What if I put this... You're just a weirdo, but you're fine. But you see the head proportion? Yeah. That's what... Yeah. The re you, you look like a fucking... Um, uh, 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 Funko Pop. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like this... Okay, like this it looks... Yeah, it Your normal fine. head is fine. The leggings match the armor. Trust, yeah. you know? But it, it's the boar helmet is a fucking cheat code, big head, <laughs> NBA jam. <laughs> yes. You know? So that's why uh, bigger pants match the, the aesthetic. Fuck yeah, fashion souls. Absolutely. Yeah, I want to look good for now. Mm -hmm. it, it looks... It, it absolutely matches. Hell yeah. Okay, yep. if problems arise, then big, we'll change. Big pants match a big head. But right now... I am the shit. You look at me? Yeah, I'm the shit. You hear me? Hi. Well, good talking to you, Donald. Feel yourself. Just a bit. Take him where you got him. Um... Go talk to uh, the um, the the sorcery boy. Okay. Oh, hello. You made it. Then let us begin. As promised, I shall bequeath Master Logan's sorcery to you. Two things are required. Uh, yeah. First, just uh, go to the um, oh. go to the, his, his stuff. Okay. Uh, he can sell you a second set of soul spears for forty k if you wanted to shoot more. Because you get another four slots, four or another another four for the for the one slot. So you buy multi two, and you can fill two slots, and you it? equip both. And then when you're out in one slot, you have more. I didn't even think about that. If if you're like in that sp that spell, I didn't even think about that. Um. Uh... No, wait. There was a crystal soul spear. Crystal that I soul wanted. spear coming in at, at 36. Uh, no, how much? 44. 44 intelligence. 44 intelligence, yeah. That's far, though. Mm -hmm. Goodbye, then. Dude. That also means you can do soul spear, soul spear, crystal soul spear. <laughs> yeah. Pop, 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 pop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna take some money, but you can do it. Six levels away, it's not too far. Yeah. Well, you know. levels are are, for, are farther and fewer, uh -huh. fewer in between. Trust. Oh, hello. You made it. Then let us begin, as promised. Or if you're feeling like a, a fancy fucking reloader, you can shoot and rotate the the spell slot each time. <laughs> Pop. Sh Pop, sh pop, sh pop, 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 <laughs> switch guns, you know, yeah, anyways. Oh. Yeah, you, you just put new ideas in my head right now, the, like this double soul spear. And you then can, like, you can, you have slots, right? That's what you do. 
Um, and I mean, like, you mentioned uh, attunement, but, like, let's just get it out of the way right now. Like, you know... I'm not going to put into um, you're gonna, stats. It's going to cost you, like, 80,000 to get your, you know, probably your next attunement slot. 80,000? Well, here, let, let's... let's. Um, that doesn't sound bad. Hold on, let's... let's That's two levels, huh? Let's... Goodbye, then. Let's Do get the count. I'm at 14. If it's two levels, then it's worth considering. If it's, like, four or more, then I would forget about it. Uh, you're Even at 14, so yes. your next slot comes at 16. Huh. So, yeah, it would cost you 80,000. But, oh man! But I'm not but like, buying the other things. Well, then. this is what I'm talking about, yeah. right? So that's where it's like, I think, for the sake of seeing, like, an extra slot's nice, but it shouldn't be as high. It probably shouldn't be as high priority as like getting the spell you want and being able to cast it, right? Yeah. Is so, it 40k for the crystal uh, soul spear? Crystal soul spear? I think it was uh, more than that. I think it was oh, more shit. than that. Um, regular soul spear is is forty, right? So crystal is is more. Um, so you're gonna want to get your levels to the casting. You want to get your intelligence where it needs to be to forty four, and right? then after consider, and then you're gonna get the money to buy the actual thing, and then you're talking about um, adding a slot. Okay, you know. So yeah, let's pump the intelligence, and buying the extra spears will come later for now. It, the, the 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 extra four regular soul spears. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Um. Oh, hello. Then. Let us yeah. Yeah. You are level eighty-one right now, or eighty-two, I think. Yes. Um. You. Then. Do stay. You only have so many more. Yeah. Before you're gonna be done, right? Um, I mean, every time you go to that load screen, you saw pockets sitting there, and I knew Game Plus and cashed out, so I didn't. That's not the level I beat it at. That's the level I cashed out at. Okay. On my new Game Plus. All right. You know, so like, yeah, you you've got, <laughs> you know, you've got only a couple levels left. So I'd say. Okay. Then. Without grinding, of course. This is 20k souls in my pockets. Yeah. I will move on for okay. now. And... Decide a bit later. Mm -hmm. And if you ever decide to commit to your look, like I said, uh, then you can... Buff the pants and buff, the you armor. Can, you can buff whatever you have committed to. Okay. Um, did you have a Firekeeper Soul? Did you already do that? I think I used it. You already used it. Yeah, okay, cool. Alrighty. So, um, yeah. If you hit the Daughters of Chaos, you can actually, uh... Yeah. Get the, um... You can go down and look at that other item. That was on the ledge. True with my new my new ring that I worked so hard for. Foom. So it was down this way. Still have the ring on, right? Nope. Oh. Uh, good. Down the hole. Demon ruins. Yeah. Yeah. It's time enough. Don't walk. Just, just chill, fellas. Come on. 
I want parasites. Uh -huh. <laughs> right through the lava. I'm not afraid anymore. Nor should you be. Firewalkers. Will you firewalk with me? Yes, so... Come here. Get trolled. Get trolled. Get trolled. Monsters stomping on you. Get trolled. There it is. Right? And you're like... Come here. That's uh, all. Uh, die. Uh, uh, die. That's all. Uh, That's uh, all. Die. Oh, what's going on? And then the game wants that this part to troll you. It wants to have you come running for the, that item, not see the one in the middle of the fire, and have these motherfuckers hounding on you. And you look at this and you go, "What the fuck is this?" That's just silly. That's the interaction that the game wanted, and I'm, I, I simply was trying to preserve some semblance of that. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's all. Thanks, game. Because the kids, it's for nothing. It's for a stupid soul. But it's not, because there's a red fucking a ember there. Which you should go give to uh, the appropriate blacksmith, by the way. Right. But, like, you know. Oh, well, key items. I got a bunch of embers. It's a. Uh, yeah, you have a bunch of embers. Not to mention something you can go drop into the uh, Lord, Lord vessel. vessel. Um. But yeah, you, uh, whatever, anyway. There's an elab- it's an elaborate troll sequence. That, uh... <laughs> that FromSoft was hoping you would fall for. Well, I did. So, um, is it the giant blacksmith that will take my amber? Uh, what does the description say? Ancient methods for the Chaos Flame Ember. Ancient methods uh -huh. for the Large Flame Ember. Uh, yeah, it, it, that's not what it said for the giant who you gave the, uh, yeah, the crystal. crystal. Yeah, so that would probably be someone else. Is it, is it, is it uh, Bamas? Someone older. Yes. Bamas is pretty bony. Yes, yes it is. So that bonfire would be I haven't heard the lines but uh, I do know that oh well, I heard I heard it once I think but I do know that uh, like if you try to bring something to Andre that he can't take he'll just be like oh I can't handle that boy yeah. oh really so that so there's there's dialogue for uh, are you twitching I kind of want to look like you're twitching oh I'm stressed already <laughs> oh no he's nervous oh no anyway yeah you can um, you can go and give them the the flames what were you saying um I was thinking about going to see Andre and see what he says about it oh well then you'd want to go to uh, the parish and then for Vamos, it would be the uh, catacombs. Okay. It's been a while since I've seen him. I want to see what Andre says. But yeah, Vamos is your fire boy. Oh, uh, okay. Rickert is your magic boy. Giant is your crystal boy. And uh, Andre is the rest. someone else. That's fair, buddy. Oh, yes. And one other thing about the dark root god. So the same stuff. Said to yeah, okay. Only. Cheers, mate. Won't be seeing you then. Be careful out there. Thanks. 
Don't walk away. Don't piss him off. Good social links, you know? Mm -hmm. Sir Artorius, the Abyss Cripwalker. <laughs> Catacombs. 